Okay, here's the plan. I want to flip this Arbutus because I'm on a grade. You see? I'm almost out of gas in this truck too. I'm on a grade here. But I don't want to cut like this and then cut down. I want to flip this up. And then as I flip it up, it's going to land on this. I might even think about bringing this other one over. Now, this is what I know that. Now the trick is on this, we're lucky. We've got daylight because there's a hump in the wood. But the trick is with this, what you do is you put what we call a roll. Instead of pulling the log straight, what would be nice if I had an A-frame up high and we could get it to kind of pull up high, but we don't have that. So, now, how, come on, give me daylight. Oh yeah, baby, I got daylight, I got daylight. This is what I'm talking about. Now, we can actually roll this and it's gonna pull like this, but it's gonna roll the log because I'm gonna put this, I should almost, almost be smart to get over there a bit, if I could, so. This this works. It works. I've done it tons. I'm just hoping this isn't too heavy for me. It's a big piece of bloody wood. I might even throw the tongs on for insurance. Okay, so now that by rights should roll. Okay, it should roll. And I'm just gonna, okay, I'm gonna tighten up on this and see what happens. I <laughs> okay. <laughs> you, you, see what you see what I'm talking about? I like that. That is beautiful. Okay, so now, guys, you, you see what I'm talking about, eh? I just got to nip that little piece off right there. I might even freehand that and take that off. And now I'm cutting beautiful, straight crotch pieces of, of Arbutus. I'm tickled with that last maneuver. Straight up tickled, okay? Look at this, guys and gals, women and children, okay? So, so here we are. So we'll probably end up having to maybe, yeah, see this? I can move this and prop this up. Yeah, this is looking really good. Oh, you just gotta, you gotta think ahead with this stuff. You can always better your circumstances if you just think, stop, think. This, this made this wonderful. I'm gonna cut this. I'm gonna cut this today, I think. Depends, I gotta go see Bob Walker so I don't get wrapped up in too much here. What time is it? It is, uh, well, he said, he said one, so I might be able to get a cut, but mind you, I gotta swap that power saw out, so we'll see, we'll see. Stoked with that move. Thanks for hanging in on this one with me. Just a quick thing, it's just, a, I, I, when I do stuff like this, like I've been doing this for so long, and these little tricks come up, I just like to share them with you guys because that is a heavy, heavy piece of wood in order, we didn't need to drag it anywhere, we just needed to roll it. But if you need to drag it, roll it first, get it moving, get your truck moving, and hit, pour the coals to it and get it to do whatever. I don't have any machinery here, I'm working like an Egyptian. You know, so, loggers are innovative people. They are, I'm, I'm not just, I'm not trying not to be funny, they are. They're resourceful people. And, and uh, I just, I love it. I love it. I think I can live with that. Okay, we're set up. <clears throat> That's about all I can do right now. I just don't have the time. I'm going over to the, the, the famous Bob Walker's place. I'm bringing a couple of McCullers over and we're gonna go have a blast with the old, you wait to see this guy's place. All the old vintage stuff, his, his, his uh, diplomas from McCullough School, like groovy stuff from like 62, 63. It's gonna be fun, really fun. I'm going over there at one o'clock. I'm just so stoked. But I gotta meet Shaw TV here in about half an hour first before I go. So I gotta close this wood thing down here now and we'll pick you up over at Bobby's place, over at the Bob Walker's place. 
Bob and Holly's. Talk to you then. Join the journey. Come Beyond along. Over and out.